Geothermal Energy by Jaden, Zane, Keegan, and Carissa. Geothermal Energy is a renewable source. Everything starts with hot water that is produced underground in a production well. It goes up a pipe and turns into steam. When the steam goes into the turbine, and some of it goes into an injection well, some of it goes to the generator. In the generator, the steam turns into voltage. The voltage then goes into electric towers. It generate geothermal energy generates electricity heating electric furnaces. The turbine moves, making the generator spin. The magma to and a well two miles down generates dry heat with steam. Even though geothermal energy is a great energy source, not many countries actually use it. The countries that do use it though use it a lot. The five countries that use it the most are the USA, specifically California, El Salvador, Kenya, the Philippines, and Iceland. Four of those countries, El Salvador, Kenya, Philippines, and Iceland, use geothermal energy for more than 10% of its energy. Geothermal energy can only be used in specific spots due to relying on underground heat. It needs to be used in a spot where there's either a lot of fresh water, a lot of fresh water steam, or both. Geothermal energy has advantages and disadvantages. Advantages of geothermal energy are it's good for the environment and it's clean. Also, it doesn't require any fuel or emit any harmful pollutants into the air. The disadvantages of this energy is that it costs lots of money, there's not much fresh water, and the location is limited. It's mostly in the west of the U.S. Large quantities of water, of fresh water are used to make steam. Lastly, people who live in areas of the world where there's only dry heat, won't get fresh water for drinking, cooking, and bathing. That's all about geothermal energy.